Welcome back to another Unturned video. Today I went on a Washington PvP server full of roof camping groups, admin abusers with MK2s and a bunch of bases everywhere and I completely destroyed everyone. You guys are showing tremendous support in the last few videos and I really appreciate it. Last video I asked for 350 likes and you guys reached it so today let's aim for 400 likes. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, each one helps the channel grow a ton and we're getting very close to 23,000 subscribers. Last video I announced a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. To claim your prize make sure to join my discord and contact me there. Today we're going to roll another one and it's a lovely mosaic ego fire to enter this giveaway like subscribe and comment something below channel members have a higher chance to win and if someone wishes to become a member is the link in the description below also i want to announce that i have my own on turn network we have six servers including an arid pve server two modded pvp servers an elver vanilla plus and two semi vanilla pvp servers if you guys want to play the discord link for it is in the description below i will also put all the ips and ports there too and i hope you guys will have a good time and let's get straight into the video Alright, so I am on the server. Now, I have played on the PI version of the server, but yeah, there are exactly the same kits. Night Trader kit, and then there's going to be a Heartbreaker kit. Both have a cooldown of 30 minutes. Alright, so the server is actually high population. It's high times loot as well. Yeah, this man just dropped two diving tanks, okay. Alright, so as always on this kind of server, what I'm going to try to do is... First of all, I'm gonna probably try to take over a base. I'm going to keep one of the diving tanks on me as well, maybe, I don't know. In the future, I decide to build an underwater base or a sky base, which is not something that I usually do. Usually, I don't even build my own base, usually I just take over one. But yeah, I will take over a base, and then we will start getting into PvP. The server has admin abuse, at least on the PI server, but I'm pretty sure that this one will have as well. Alright, so I'm starting to get metal as well. We need metal in order to build the base, at least for a door or a saw and all of that. We have already got ourselves a stack of metal scrap. Let's go. Now, there's a vault system in the server. I'm going to put a bed, the scrap, and the diving tank. Just in case I do die, they will still be safe. I already hear a plane. That's right, it's not even a plane from this map. But yes, this server is paid to win, as you guys probably can tell. Every single person we will find will have a kit, because they could do kits very easily, especially if they're admin. I don't want them to see me, but if they do jump off, I will try to kill them, but yeah, he's just gonna keep going straight above me. I do hear Heartbreaker shots over at Seattle. Now I'm gonna chop down this tree, get myself some logs, and we're gonna take over this half-built base. All I need is a 2x1, I don't want anything bigger. There are currently 27 players on the server, which is, you know, quite a ton for a medium-sized map. Alright, so first we'll get ourselves a pillar, we'll place it right over here. And we still gotta get ourselves a couple of more logs, we'll place a wall here as well. Now we could put the bed already over here, that way once I get myself logs I wouldn't have to walk all around and all of that. I could just slash home. Well, I see a guy over there, I don't think he has anything actually, yeah. My guy's a fresh spawn, but I'm still gonna kill him. He could just do slash kit nitrate day and just laser me down, and we don't want that. Uh, I think this should be enough logs now. Alright, so the shooting over at Seattle actually hasn't stopped. I'm actually kind of scared to go there because I, I have a feeling that I might get completely lasered. Uh, so I got myself two sheets, so now we can make ourselves a saw. And then all these planks into a couple of sticks. We get ourselves a crate. Okay, so an airdrop is actually landing right over here, which is probably the most overpowering thing on the server because last time I got an airdrop on the PI server, there were literally 20 charges. Now, if this one has the exact same thing, then we would probably be extremely lucky. All right, well, dropped. There's also a bunch of random stuff on the floor. And, okay, well, it's not a charge airdrop, but it has a bunch of guns. It has a saber tooth, nitrate there. A bunch of gas masks. I mean, we don't really need those. I will take the Elise back, though, for sure. The night vision... We could wear one. Let's take the Elise back, extra backpack. Uh, and we home. And I saw a guy as soon as I homed, oh my god. Right, well, I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna depot here, and we're gonna kill that man. Hopefully he has some good stuff. We got ourselves also a Zubeknikov, which is probably the best weapon in Unturned, in my opinion at least. But for now, I will keep running around with the Nitrate there. Alright, so this man's probably looting the- oh, he doesn't even have anything. I'm still gonna see what he had. Oh yeah, he just had stuff from the airdrop, pretty much. I will right, we'll take the remaining ammunition. Alright, so I'm going to need myself some more storage because I am full already with the one crate that I put. I could put some guns in vault. That way if I die, I will always have backup weapons. Alright, so I hear FAMAS shots. I'm gonna go quickly get that gun. Probably at the airdrop still. Yes sir, one guy there. He's dead. There's another dude. Dead as well. Let's check out their load. Fussy lot. Some ammo. And this man had a viper. A bunch of ammo. A bunch of attachments as well. Alright, we home. I still haven't made myself the second crate, actually. I'm gonna drop these on the floor so that way if I die, they wouldn't get them. They will still be safe inside the base. Get ourselves a saw, and let's chop ourselves some trees. Made myself a bunch of crates, now we should have more than enough space. Even though most of them are already full. So everything in base should be set, I hear viper shots, let's go. Quickly kill him. Right, that's a clear water, I see him from here. 
he is dead. He probably only has a Viper kit, but I'm still gonna check out if he may have anything else that's important. Yeah, we didn't leave anything important in the airdrop good. Now, since everything in base is done, now it's time to actually start leaving the area. He had a Viper. There's a guy right over there. I'm not gonna kill him. I don't think he actually has anything, but if he... Yeah, he's swimming over here, so I will kill him. And it is actually two guys. It's not a solo player. One of them's right here. He's dead. Alright, he's dead. Uh, this man, Nitrator kit, I will gladly take that. As for the second individual, we need to find out where he is underwater. Oh uh, yeah, he's right here. My guy had a Shadow Stalker and some rails. I will gladly take that as well. Shadow Stalker, very good. Alright, let's put these guns inside the storage. We'll put some extra ammo as well. For the Shadow Stalker, I have no space for it, actually. I'm gonna drop one of those. Alright, so next I will probably try to go to see Hetzel and Military. Oh, well, I'm already... I'm dead. Nice. Well, that was terrible. I didn't even last five seconds inside Seattle. I'll take the only night trader that I have that's not in my vault. Probably camping on the tower or in a building or something. It is a high population server and Seattle, you know, is going to be swarmed with players. And there's a naked guy over there. I'm not gonna kill him though. That will easily give my position away and that's not good. There's a guy looting me. Oh, he's dead. But it is not the same guy that killed me. The guy that killed me is named Alibaba. I'm still gonna go and try to take my loot and then we'll try to home or something like that. There's a guy right over there. I'm gonna kill him though. Oh, he's dead. Oh yeah, he's on the tower. I'm dead. Yeah, it's the same guy. Alright, so we got ourselves a crane camper. I know exactly how to deal with that. I will take myself a saber tooth, a scope and a grip. I'm gonna take myself some extra ammunition. Probably won't need it though, but let's give this one more try. He's probably still looting me once again then. Oh yeah, he definitely is. Look at him. Oh, he's dead. I gotta kill this dude up here. There we go, he's dead. Easy. I don't know if there's even more, but I'm gonna just run straight to the loot. Yeah, I don't see anyone up there. Yeah, from here, hopefully he wouldn't be able to hit me. Oh right, yeah, the two Night Raiders are both here. Heartbreakers are back. Yeah, this is the guy that I killed twice down here. Right, so I'm actually doing a loot run over at Heritage, and I just looted military as well. Got myself a bunch of guns, a bunch of 7x scopes. Now we are back in base. Now I will depot extra guns, and all of the extra ammo, and all of that. Somebody just got killed right outside my base. Alright, well I will use the Heartbreaker for now. Now where did that guy go? Oh wait, it was just a naked man. He's right over there. I'm gonna follow him. We're gonna put a 7x scope on it. There's still a lot of shooting happening over at Seattle, man. I think we picked a bit of a bad location to build our base, to be honest. Right, where is this dude? Oh, he's right over there. I see. Oh, wait, that's a naked. That's not even him. Oh, he's right there. Alright, he's dead. Let's kill the naked. Oh, there was a third dude. Alright, no problem. Let's just take ourselves a gun. The Zubek. We could take one of the drums, though. I don't need the Viper. Oh yeah, I see a guy. I don't think it's the same person though. Oh, Night Trader shots. Oh, one guy here. He's dead. Bro, die already. Oh, he's dead. My aim there was a bit potato for a sec. Alright, drums. Heartbreaker. Full forest military on Washington. That's very normal. Oh right, yeah, my vault is full. I forgot about that. I was going to vault one of the guns. Right, I'm just gonna run straight up to where I killed the second dude. Yeah, my loot is still there. They didn't even loot me. Night Trader, Heartbreaker. Chainsaw, I'll take that actually. Now, this is still my loot. Yes, sir. It's all still here. And this is the first dude that I killed. Alright, we're actually gonna get stacked from this. Yeah, Heartbreaker, Night Trader. I'm just gonna take the guns home. And we are back. There we go. I just got everything back. And a, a lot more. There's a guy down there. He seems... Full geared. He's dead. Let's check out what loot he has. I heard shots over a scorpion, by the way. Shadow Stalker, Viper, all of that. Oh, there's a guy in there. Alright, and he killed me. Bro, why is it everywhere I go, there's always more people after I kill somebody? It's actually insane. I'm gonna take the Night Raider. Let's go back, try to kill the same dude that just killed me. They're probably a duo, so he TP'd back. At least I'm not that far, though. Oh, I think he left. Oh, he's right here. My guy's just standing still. <laughs> Alright, he's dead. Uh, Night Trader, at least back. Yeah, he didn't even take my loot, I think. Except the gun. I got shot. Ouch. That hurt. Shadow Stalker. At least they didn't headshot me. They would have killed me. Oh, yeah, I did see where he is, by the way. He's over at the hill next to Scorpion. I'm just gonna crawl to my loot so that we don't leave it here. Let's take the chainsaw. Alright, this is the first dude that... Oh, he has a maple strike! Right, this is the first maple strike we saw all day. Alright, so I stripped these guns. We'll put some attachments on the maple. Got ourselves a drum in as well. I'm gonna try to kill the Scorpion 7 dude with the shadow. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh no, he missed. What gun was he using? He could have killed me so easily. He just started shooting from far away. I hit him once. You know what? I'm just gonna move around though. I'm scared that I'm gonna get in between two people. Now let's go try to kill the Shadow Stalker guy first. This guy probably has a Viper or Peacemaker kit and it's not really worth it for now. 
Oh yeah, Viper shots inside Scorpion. There's a guy. Oh, Shadow Stalker. Okay. Let's just jump around so hopefully he don't hit me. Oh, he actually hit me again. Bro, this guy has a good aim. Oh, he's up there. I see him. He's behind the tree. Oh, there's two of them actually. Somebody else shot us though. All right, there's a guy on top of the building, I think. They're fighting each other. Oh yeah, one killed another dude. All right, this guy's dead. I'm gonna run inside Scorpion. Oh, there's a guy there as well. He's dead. Let's check out the roof. I think the guy on the hill killed the guy on the roof, right? Oh yeah, there's a loot pile over here. Oh yeah, we'll take the shadow, all the rails. And then I killed the guy that killed the guy up here, which is kind of epic. All right, let's fill up the drum. 100 shots, let's go. No, I actually forgot where I killed him. Where's his loot? Oh no, shadow sucker right over here. Oh, he ran out of rails, poor man. Oh. Bro. <laughs> okay, well, this guy's aim is uh, a bit po. Now, this could have been the guy that was shooting me over at Everton, actually. He followed me all the way over here. Okay, well, I am full of loot, so I should probably home, actually. I'm getting shot at from behind. Oh, he shouldn't, he's actually literally behind me. Oh, he's right there. I saw him, yeah. Let's move over here. Oh, he's dead. My guy had a peacemaker kit. I don't know why he was tapping with it. He could have easily just killed me. An airdrop is coming down as well. All right, I'm gonna go for it, definitely. Hopefully this time we get ourselves the airdrop full of charges and rocket. That would be insane, to be honest. I could literally raid any base I would want. Oh, there's a guy up there. He, I think he got the airdrop. I'm gonna kill him, though. He's dead. I was scared he was gonna home or something like that. I could have gotten closer, but anyway, he's dead now, so it doesn't matter. Alright, please. The good airdrop, I beg. Alright, so, uh, no, it's not. Alright, well, drums. Uh, this guy picked up the guns. Yeah, I have maple strike, though. Oh, sorry, shooting an ace. He's dead. Well, this airdrop had a maple strike by the looks of it. A bunch of ammo, master key, I think. A fussy lot, actually, that could have been inside as well. I'm not gonna take it, though. I don't really use it. We'll take the night vision. Check out I didn't leave anything important. Uh, blunt force, we could take that. There's a bunch of chopped trees over here. I'm making some crates because they're already full. Uh, I heard somebody outside, though. All right, he's right there. I don't think he has anything but... Yeah, he just has an ace kit. All right, back to making crates, then. Oh, well, there's a sentry in here, but thankfully it's out of ammo. I would have died there. Oh, what? Hello there. Yeah, there's a lot of shots over here happening. It's like the whole server is fighting each other. Maybe I could spray everything down from here, actually. There's a guy there. He's dead. Another guy there. Dead as well. Third guy dead. All right. Easy. Should I even bother going for the loot? I mean, I'll probably die, to be honest. You know what? I'm gonna give it a try. If I die, I die. If I don't die, then we're gonna get ourselves a, a lot of loot. There's a guy up there, so that as well and there's still more right here oh yeah there's still like there's admins and all of that in this in this area and there's maple strike shots above me we can't build plates on areas where there's like build builds on the server it's kind of weird there's a naked guy over here and speaking in game there's another dude there's like three people and I got killed from behind. There was like the fourth guy then. Uh, I do have a heartbreaker and a scope on me. I'm gonna loot military really quickly. Let's try to get myself more ammo. Maybe more guns. Then we'll try to hit Seattle up once again. But yeah, it was kind of a bad idea to go there after I killed those people. There's smokes inside the military. So there's somebody in here as well. Yeah, there's shots too. Yeah, somebody's having fun with smokes in here. Yeah, he's right inside this bunker. Yeah, my guy's right here. He's dead. He had full spec ops by the looks of it. Yes, sir. Okay, two guns. My guy went inside the dead zone in Washington. Right, I'm gonna pick up these clothes. All right, we got ourselves a helmet as well. All right, let's go back to Seattle and give it a try. If I get myself some guns, I will just home though. All right, there's a guy right over there. He's dead. There's people shooting shadows, maple strikes, everything over here. This man had a viper kit, some ammo for his back. I don't know if they actually did go for the loot. For where I, oh, there's a loot pile right over here. Nitrator, Eagle Fire, bunch of drums. Heartbreaker as well. There's a lot of people speaking in game. In Russian or whatever they're talking, I don't know. Alright, there's, there's people mad. Heartbreaker. We were the Elise pack. Hey, my Maple Strike is still here. Alright, yeah. Okay, well, what matters is I got my Maple Strike then. And a bunch of guns, actually. Not too bad. Right, there's two guys on the bridge. One guy dead. There's people on top of the gray building as well. I'm gonna try to kill this dude down here somewhere. Yeah, he's right over there. He's dead. Wait, does he even have anything? Nope, my guy's naked. Let's check out the first dude that I killed then. Alright, well, this guy at least has some guns. He has a Shadow Stalker, a couple of rails, Viper. There's people up there. I headshot him. Ouch, I got hit though. Alright, I'm gonna med up. Yeah, I'm gonna drop down. They know exactly where I am. I'm getting shot at. Oh, I'm getting shot at from up on the hill now. He's dead. Let's mad up. Try to get for his load. I think he had the maple strike, actually. Oh, MK2. I'm 
getting shot at by an MK2. <laughs> we love to see that. It's kind of OP now that the MK2 one shoot one shot near you. There's the explosion shake or whatever it is. That that's very very OP. Let's check out this man had. Uh, all right, he's actually stacked. Maple Strike with the W has a blowtorch as well. That's something that I've been looking for this whole time. A lot of ammo. All right, we're back in base. All right, third airdrop. There's two guys there. Uh, about that, one of them's an admin. Maybe he's the MK2 admin, actually. Yo, are we gonna about to get an MK2? Let's check out the airdrop. All right, yeah, it's the same airdrop as before, just a bunch of guns. Take the night vision as per usual. As for what they had, okay, Maple Strike PW, a billion drums, literally. All right, let's vault. Let's take the guns and let's get the hell out of here. High caliber as well. Yeah, I'm full. All right, time to home. Well, alright everybody, that's going to be it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed. If you guys do want to see more videos on this server, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!